The abuse prosecutions follow one of Britain's biggest police investigations of its kind involving almost 1,500 ex-inmates. The officer in charge believes more will be prosecuted. The men, who worked at Medom's Lee Detention Centre near Consett, County Durham, will appear before Newton Aycliff magistrates in December. Durham police launched Operation Seabrook more than four years ago into alleged abuse at the centre, which closed in 1988. A police spokesman said the seven men, who are aged from 61 to 73, will appear on December 19 to answer charges of misconduct in a public office and alleged physical abuse offences. Some will also answer UAL abuse charges, the police said. Durham police said more than 1,480 men have contacted the inquiry team to report allegations of either UAL or physical assaults while detained at Medomsley, with some claims dating back to the 1960s. Those charged are Christopher Onslow, 71, Brian Johnson Greenwell, 70, Alan Bramley, 69, John McGee, 73, Kevin Blakely, 65, David McClure, 62 and Neil Sowerby, 61. Teenage inmates at the Young Offenders Center typically spent six to eight weeks at the home officer on facility before being released. Detective Chief Superintendent Adrian Green, leading the investigation, said there are more suspects that we are investigating and, as the weight of evidence develops and our identification improves of those individuals, I am very confident that more people will face prosecution in the future, though next year. The investigation is also looking into the deaths of three young men who died while imprisoned at the center.